Greetings, Wizkins. Marketing wizard Jim Ackerman here with yet another marketing tip of the day. And for the last several tips, we focused on the ADA formula. I want to go back today and revisit the first two points of the ADA formula, A and I. Remember, it's attention, interest, desire, and action. Today, we're going to take another look at attention and interest. And uh, we're going to do it in the context of the headline. Now, first of all, you must realize that every ad has a headline. Even broadcast ads have a headline. It's the first things out of the mouth of the person who's talking in that particular case. Sales presentations have a headline. When your face-to-face -face salesperson walks in to talk to somebody, the first words out of his mouth will accomplish, hopefully, the first two responsibilities of the ad. That is, capture attention, convert the attention into interest. That's the job of the headline. Now, look, the headline may contribute to desire. The headline may contribute to action, but it absolutely must accomplish the first two jobs, attention and interest, if it's going to be successful. Most headlines fail to do this, and that's why most ads are unsuccessful. Think about it. 50% of the work of the entire ad must be accomplished by your headlines. What this tells you is you ought to spend more time working on your headlines and making sure they're good. That's it for today's marketing tip. Now, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and leave your comments below. And don't forget to enter our new subscriber contest. The more subscribers you refer, the greater the chance that you'll win prizes. Each week, a prize will be awarded to the person who refers the most new subscribers. Each month, the person who refers the most new subscribers for the month, and on November 13th, will award the person who refers the most subscribers between now and then to a brand spanking new Principal Centered Marketing Coaching Program, a $7,200 value. The details for the contest are just coming up, so stay tuned and find out what you need to do to win that $7,200 prize. Over $20,000 in prizes are give, being given away in this contest. Don't forget to get your share. Be a whizkin, not a poof. And we'll see you next time with another marketing tip to help you get more customers who will pay you more money more often, the fastest, easiest, most cost-effective ways possible.